To attract and engage my audience, I carried out some primary research and this included questionnaires and vox pops. Primary research is important when creating a thriller film as it tells you who your target audience is and what things your target audience like and expect to see in a thriller film. This is important as when creating my production, I knew what things to include and what things my target audience would want to see. I therefore would have to base my plot and narrative around what my target audience like in order to engage the audience I want into watching my sequence. Primary research is also important, especially Vox Pops, as you can ask someone a question and they can give you an elaborative answer which explains exactly what they want to see. When carrying out primary research, I composed a questionnaire that I would ask different people. The answer given gave me an insight in um, gave me a rough idea when planning my thriller narrative and what to include. I also did a vox pop on three people who told me what they want they would prefer to see when watching a thriller. Some of the questions I asked were, what is your favourite weapon in a thriller film? And some of the answers given were, knife, gun, saw and axe. The highest response was knife and so I applied this to my thriller. Another question asked was, would you rather see a female or male victim? And finally, another question asked was, what is a typical location for a thriller? And some of the answers that they gave was an abandoned house, forest, basement and a hospital. When planning my narrative, I looked at the responses that people gave me and tried to apply them to my thriller. For example, knife was the most favourite weapon and so in my narrative I decided to include a knife in order to engage my audience more. This was evident throughout my thriller as the killer would hold the knife as a way to kill the victim. I also found out that most people would prefer to see a female victim and this is because it is stereotypical to the thriller genre and typically shown in all thriller films. Hospital was one of the main responses for a typical location, however this would be unrealistic when filming my production as it is too hard of a location to film in and it is unavailable to us. Primary research helps me when planning as I know what to include in my narrative which would engage my audience. It helps me to understand what my audience would like to see and this helps my narrative be the most appealing to my target audience. I also carried out secondary research and this involved looking at other people, other thriller films and gaining ideas and inspirations. I carried out secondary research in order to find out what other productions were doing to engage their audience. I looked at thrillers such as Paranormal Activity, Final Destination and Scream to see what conventions they used and the style of their plot they used. I gained some inspirations of what I could include in my thriller and apply this to my narrative. By looking at other thrillers, it has widened my knowledge on how to engage my target audience and keep them intrigued throughout the film. Secondary research has helped me when creating and planning my thriller, as it has inspired me to use conventions that I may not have thought of myself. It has also helped me as I have looked at professional work and seen how editing, lighting, sound and mise-en-scene can all make a good and engaging thriller film. This is shown throughout Paranormal Activity and Final Destination as some of the techniques they used was close up and low angle to make the um, to make the victim seem very weak and the killer seem very patronising. A close up was also used to show the facial expressions and to also lead the audience into suspense as to what is going to happen next. Secondary research has also given me ideas about what plot I can include in order to intrigue a particular target audience. I analysed how specific camera shots can help build a relationship between the characters and audience and how sounds can build up tension and leave the audience in suspense. By carrying out secondary research, it has made planning a lot easier and has made me think what I can include in order to keep my audience intrigued throughout without them getting bored.